If you're looking for a new electric trolley in 2016, one brand that you might not know an awful lot about is Big Max. They're actually famed for their push trolley innovations. and They're actually the most used push trolley in Europe. And I have in front of me the Coaster Quad Brake and the Navigator Quad Gyro. One thing you'll all notice when taking a quick look at both of these is that they both have four wheels. Um, well, actually, that's not true. They both have five wheels, but I'll come, come on to that in a moment. Essentially, they're made from four wheels, and there's two at the back, which provide a wide base for uh, really strong stability, but then there's two more at the front, which aid that stability even further, but crucially mean that both trolleys have an on-the-spot maneuverability, and that means that you don't have to manhandle the trolley in order to get it to go where you want it to. Uh, the knock-on effect of that is that you're not putting so much stress through the body of the trolley, and it should aid the reliability. Uh, you also have a, an electronic uh, parking brake to ensure the trolley stays upright uh, if ever you're playing on a really undulating golf course or you're looking to park the trolley on the side of a hill. Both trolleys have a lithium battery as standard. If you haven't had the chance to test uh, lithium battery electric trolleys yourselves, uh, I would thoroughly uh, advise it. It's very interesting. The lithium batteries are a lot lighter. Uh, they mean the trolleys can be folded down and put into the boot of the car without the battery having to be removed. There is a solar panel charging unit that sits into the trolley uh, in the console unit uh, and allows your GPS unit or your mobile phone to be charged as you're playing golf. So um, some great technology for both of these trolleys. The Coaster is their classic electric trolley design. It has a single push button here that enables the trolley to go. The same button enables the trolley to stop. And um, you also have the functionality of being able to send the trolley forward up to 60 yards as well. And finally, the other piece of technology that I really like about this is that it has a downhill speed regulator. So anytime you're using the trolley on a particularly undulating golf course, you can do so in confidence that the trolley's not going to try and get away from you as you go downhill. The speed will be regulated to go at your normal walking pace. With the Navigator, the big difference is the introduction of a remote control. Uh, and actually, the key technology that really unlocks this usability while you're out on the golf course is the um, quad gyro system. So it's, a, it's essentially a gyroscopic technology that ensures that whenever the trolley is moving across a side slope, the gyroscopic technology corrects the path of the trolley so it never starts wandering off in a direction that you don't want it to go in. Uh, it's a very simple but incredibly innovative uh, and really useful piece of technology that should make this a really useful trolley to have. Now, we are here at the links at Royal St. Ports. We're very lucky to have pretty much free reign of the place today. Uh, and we're gonna give these two trolleys a really good test. Okay, so we've had a great couple of hours out here on the links at Royal Sank Ports, uh, testing both of these trolleys. Now, the Navigator isn't out until summer, autumn 2016. Keep your eyes peeled on the Big Mac's website for details on that. So that's why I'm gonna focus on the coaster. So with the coaster, what do you get? Well, you get really simple usability. So the four wheel construction is really superb. The ability to turn the trolley on the spot um, was something that I found useful throughout the game of golf. Never once did I feel like the trolley was uh, getting away from me or I was having to really sort of pull it into position. And yes, it is a premium price trolley, but what you're getting is that engineering that makes this very easy and simple to use. And it's the same story with the Navigator. It's very simple and easy to use. And what you have here is you have five wheels that really make the Navigator, it just swallows up the terrain. At no point was I worried that it was gonna fall over. And essentially that's what uh, boils down. That's that's what makes a great remote controlled electric trolley. So there you have it, two fantastic new electric trolleys from Big Macs. Uh, if you're looking for something that's a classic electric trolley with fantastic stability or something with a bit more fun attached to it but still offering that same level of stability, I certainly would urge anyone in the electric trolley market this year to give them both a try.